97 uh, on the boats um, is that a requirement to have boats uh, and what, what do they do the, the premium seems like fifteen thousand dollars for fire two fire boats uh, has this county always had boats uh, or is this a new thing and you know, what's the cost of the whole maintaining the boats and have they ever done anything like fight a fire or you know basically are they useful I don't I don't know if Essex County yeah. has boats or if you know anybody else but oh, it just seemed like a high premium for you could tell us about uh, UC Marine 1 and UC Marine 2 so the UC Marine 1 and UC Marine 2 through you Chairman uh, obviously uh, Uni County has a uh, large waterfront uh, on the Elizabeth Lynn and Runway uh, borders. Um, the, and that was identified after, sometime after 9-11. It predated my arrival here at the county. But it was identified as a vulnerability uh, for the county by uh, working groups, Homeland Security working groups. Uh, it, the boats were purchased with uh, Homeland Security money in an effort to bulk our presence, a police presence, and a firefighting presence uh, on a waterways at Fort Worth County. They have responded to several incidences in Elizabeth and Linden for hazmat incidents uh, and law enforcement incidents. Very good. Thank you. Thank you.